Welcome back to my channel, my Garcia uh, models. How are you all doing? Hope you liked the last video I done on the um, Armored Outcast for rest. I'm now servicing the, the rear diffs now. I'm going to do the front as well. So I do a quick video on it, guys. Show you how to uh, assemble it all apart and that. And then uh, I'll probably speed the video up a bit, pause a bit, stuff like that, you know. <clears throat> so yeah, so we'll start off the back now back wing here guys getting the back wing off now okay so we lift it like this guys what I'll probably do first is taking the uh, shocks off because that's more easier take the shocks off and then once they off you assemble you take the wing off don't be too bad straightforward really so this car is all rock and roll and ready to go. Like I said, just got to do the, uh, the diffs and that, guys. Make sure they all got uh, silicone oil in it, because Armour's been known to put uh, grease in it, you know. And I don't like grease, really. Silicone's better. Because it's a 110 scale, I'm not doing a 60,000. I'm only doing about 20, 20,000, 20K in the rear. In about 15 ish in the front, so yeah, was you too much oil, it'll cause sort of problem problems, you know what I mean? So there's the uh, shots took off now, guys. There, Let's go like that, bend them all up. And all this sort of happens here, so it does all this sort of like lifts off, if you know what I mean. I'll bring it a bit closer now, guys, and you see what I mean. Okay, well, that's a bit, bit better if you know it. Yeah, so this all sort of lifts off. You've got to take the centre piece off. Um, you know, but it all takes time in the day, doesn't it? Right, there we two. So you leave that on there, see? That's one, one bit. What I'll probably do now is um, I will have to take the wheels off, I think, guys. So I'll go ahead and do the wheels. I just take this pull a bit here off. Yeah, this is sort of like things I like doing, see guys, things that S maintains to the cars. You know, keeps me busy. I like doing videos around the fields and stuff, racing around, but I find things like this is more like whoop, more satisfying, you know what I mean? Sort of ran away from me then. <laughs> yeah, so let's get that screw off there. That's it, it's coming out, guys. It's coming, coming out, so yeah. Sort of long, large screw. Yeah. Yeah, he's um, coming now. And he's off. There we go. There they are. It's always to get the uh, worst ones at the end, is it, isn't it? <laughs> Tell you what, do it, guys. I'll pause you and I'll be back, back in a minute, okay? Right guys, welcome back guys. Right, um, what I've done so far is um, I took these both sides off. Um, I took the shocks off, off, screws off on the bottom. I took complete other shocks. And these two off. And also, yeah, that's a bit now. And in a minute, I'll take this centre piece off. And then we will just lift the whole lot completely up. And there will be your centre center of diff there. Um, rear diff, sorry. So, yeah, so I'll get that done. Next, all we've got to do is lift it up like this. I'll show you guys. There we go. So you've got these sort of uh, these bloody screws. They got one in the center, and uh, then one in the center, and two there. Maybe one at the back. I think. Um, no, it's not. Just four together. Four as you just lift off. So we will do this now. This, uh, there we go. This is a 2.5 you need on these, by the way. 2.5 mil screwdriver, alley key screwdriver. <laughs> Bit tight, but yeah. Once it's off, it's off, isn't it? Chuck those of great red grease stuff. What I use is the best one. Like I said, I'm not sure to go 20,000 in the rear and probably. 10,000 in the front, something like that, you know. 
not not two more and no more than 20 because it just clogs it all up if you go too much you know what i mean guys anyway that's that massive screw it's probably about christ mine this is probably one of the longest ones they've got on here on the bottom because all the rest of the standards they've got this was probably a uh, hundred millimeter screw not far off 50 millimeter i reckon there we go guys how long that is almost as long as my finger look <laughs> but yeah i got three like that today one like two at the back like I said, they haven't got no um, Loctite in there because it's plastic. So that's one good thing. They haven't Loctite there. Normally Armored's uh, known for that to um, use red Loctite. It's very, very hard to get off red Loctite. You've got to spend a good half an hour with a hot gun and, you know. But yeah, this one's coming out, the second one. There we go. Not his way. I think it's one of the worst sort of things. This is <clears throat> makes your finger and thumbs ache a bit, isn't it? But a lot of people do use uh, electric, don't they? But I tend to do it by hand. This is in case you strip the uh, screw head. See, so it worries me when they've got to use the electric tool on there. Probably takes a little longer. Yeah. There we go. There's a second one out now, guys. Where are we going up? Number two, now go over number three. There we go. Once you've done all your diffs in all your motor cars, you more know it's all the same, you know. Yeah. <clears throat> it's all the same in the day. we have got the same gears, you know. Some's got two gears, some's got four. These have got four gears, you know. All I'm doing is taking it out, checking it. If it needs topping up, it needs topping up. But if it's like full of um, like grease, no, I won't bother. I just take it all out all together. So guys, yeah. yeah. Right now, okay, almost there. Almost there, now, guys. Uh, let's have a look. Like that, like that, guys. It, not, yeah, he's, you look, see, he's coming, but because you've got this long bar here, look, see, if you think that you lift up that, it's coming out, but you probably need to take this one out. I think that's say nut inside, so it's good. Another 2.5, yeah. Is it a 2 mil? Might be a 2 mil, guys. Two millimeters. Oh, two millimeters. Is it two mil? I cannot remember. Is it two mil to mirror? Same that. Is that what it looks like? Is that what it looks like? Or is it there, there like that? Hang on a minute. Ink. Let's have a look here. That is a. Uh... Oh, yeah, that's it. You screw it from the top, guys. Look, you know, see that little bit there? See that little screw there? You take that off, and that sort of just lifts off. Like, I thought it's taking it off from the end, but it's not, guys. It's from the top. Just literally want to do it in there. Right. Let's have a look now. We're going to see that. Uh, yeah. No. From there, I think that goes off. Might, might be wrong actually, guys. It's not that, is it? I think you're fine. I don't lose that. 
think it might be a uh, little nut. Let's have a look. Try that. Try one of those, see that work there. Don't know where you make that one there. It's probably too small. It's going to not work there, no. Let's have a look there now. Because at the end of the day, um, all right, tell you what, I do guys, I'll get back to you in a minute when I sort this out, and then, uh, yeah, see you in a bit. Hi, guys, welcome back, guys. I've had to sort it out now. This bar a bit along here, when you're going to do your rear diffs or front, you don't need to take this one off. I basically undone this as far as I could. To left it sort of a bit slack and then lift the motor out so the motor's out look you see assembled all out and then uh, the thing just lifts up like so and there we go guys like that let's see and that was a bit of a pain leave this on there but say taking it off i just sort of you know leave like that guys i know it's gonna be in the way but if you see what i mean um hang on a minute. Let's make sure it's done that properly. Um, it just sort of like end of the day, guys. I could do that. <sighs> Jobs are good, and see, <laughs> like that. I know it sounds stupid, but um, I'd rather just do that so it's up there. It's not going anywhere. Or even like that, actually. It won't actually go nowhere anyway. But no. At least I've got the diffs out, you see, guys, anyway. See you a bit closer. <clears throat> so I won't go anywhere anyway. But yeah, so I've got all the diffs out. Another good thing, it's metal. The other sort of one I've got here, um, the Votex, Armour Votex 3S, uh, I think it's, yeah, it's not brushed, this is brushed. And that is all plastic, but they've got metal. So I'm quite pleased about that, guys. Yeah, let's take her out and uh, get her all took apart. There we go. All metal, let's see, guys. Which, it's good. Yeah, that's a 13T, that is, in there. Same what I put in my other one. It looks like it's fizzed all in there, but I will take it all out and uh, take it apart. Okay, guys? <clears throat> See you soon. Um, have a nice weekend, whatever you're doing, and um, like and subscribe, okay guys?